This is the ultimate budget TV, IF Falcon 4K HDR TV. This is probably the best TV I will ever review, hands down. And guys, ang mura-mura niya sa 9.9, .9, so abangan. Meron siyang 4K Ultra HD, meron ba siyang HDR10 support, Dolby Audio. Meron na siyang built-in Chromecast, edgeless design, may Netflix na, may YouTube, may Amazon Prime Video pa. Actually, I have seen the TV na. Inunbox ko na siya, pero unbox natin ulit kasi <laughs> ang lupit niya. Let's go. Kapag si Benz and you're watching Unbox Diaries. Woohoo! Okay, so unbox na natin. One, two, mm. <gasps> Oh my God! Ang bilis lang. Magic! So, ito na siya. Si Aya Falcon 55-inch 4K Google TV. Wow. Wow. Oh. Wow. Wow. Kasi hindi, ay mag-focus mag eh. Wow. Okay. Pero yun, it's 55-inch. It has three sizes. 50, 55, and 65 inches. Guys, merong super laking freebie mamaya for the 65 inches. Oh my God! So the TV is very elegant. It looks beautiful. It looks high-end. Yung bezel's very borderless. Yung kanyang itsura. But it still has some bezels on the sides. Kita mo pa rin. Pero compared to other TVs, this looks very sleek and very elegant. Masarap ilagay sa inyong living room, sa inyong kwarto. Masarap po manood ng mga movies using this TV. Sa likod, ito yung kanyang mga ports. Meron po siyang USB 2.0, may LAN port. Meron siyang tatlong HDMI ports. May antenna. May audio out na yellow and black, which is yung headphone. Uy, may headphone jack pala to. At meron pa siyang optical out. Wow! Ito ba yung controller niya, no? The controller is very modern, very simple lang. It's got this circular pad right here at the center. Home button. And you got here shortcuts for Netflix, Prime Video, Guard, Media, YouTube, and that's pretty much it. Meron siyang two years warranty certificate. Meron pa siyang Google TV operation manual. Uy, may energy label pa siya. And looks like we have here yung kanyang RCA connector. Nice, meron siyang kasama. Now, picture quality. This one is very important, no? Yung kanya 4K HDR capabilities is right there. Siyempre, alam na yan, 4K. Ito na po yung uso ngayon. It's 2023, so kailangan mo mag-move on, guys, sa 4K kung 1080p ka pa. Now, in terms of 4K, hindi po lahat ng 4K TVs ay made the same. Some of them are not so good, not so sharp. But this one, the IF Falcon 4K HDR Google TV, is a very, very sharp, very beautiful display. Ang una ko na pansin is yung kanyang color. Wow, the, the color on this one is pretty, pretty good. Kasi nga guys, before yung mga chuchu na TV, hindi ko masyado gusto yung color. Medyo artificial na thing. This one is very close to those very expensive TVs that you see on one of the bigger brands. Yung mga OLED, yung mga ganyan, QLED TVs, which have really good brightness. Well, speaking of brightness, guys, ang bright po ng TV na to. Yung kanyang brightness is very bright na for a very dark room. Like super, super bright. Pero sa daylight guys, mag-ingat lang kayo. Kapag may sikat ng araw, tinatama yung display, baka may raron siya. But, in a very light controlled room, this one is very good performing. Pero guys, mag-ingat kayo. Kasi nga, naka low power mode siya by default. Pwede naman yung change of vivid, no? Which is what we did. And the colors and the brightness went up big time. Kaya kasi yung vivid, guys, pati may ibang settings ay hindi ganun ka-accurate for us. So we had to calibrate a little bit to sa kanyang color settings and brightness settings. Pero pang expert na kasi yun, eh. Kasi nga, mahilig ako sa mga pag-tweak-tweak na ganyan. But for most people, just go for vivid and you'll be happy with it. Now, this TV, apart from the 4K, has HDR10. Ano po yun? Well, HDR is yung, yes, pang paganda po ng image quality. When you have HDR10, mas malaki yun yung range ng inyong brightness and the color. Napansin po namin, no, kapag ka nag-Netflix po kami, pinapanood yung aming mga favorite K-dramas, this one is yung merong Dolby Vision na nakalagay, no, dun sa Netflix na thumbnail. Kaya lang kasi walang Dolby Vision po tong TV na to. So, nag-default siya sa HDR10. Ha? Huh? Anong ibig sabihin nun? Now guys, the next best thing sa Dolby Vision is yung HDR10. So, kung hindi niya mahanap yung Dolby Vision, magdi-default siya sa HDR10. Which is, may mga settings na ginawa yung mga filmmakers para mas mapaganda pa yung color and yung kanyang brightness kapag na-activate itong setting nito. And that's right, when the HDR10 kicked in, the qualities of the movies that we were watching was so incredibly sharp and detailed, we felt it was a very, very premium TV na pang 100, 200,000 pesos yung kanyang value. Kapag bright scenes po, no? Talagang kitang-kita mo pa rin yung mga details dun sa very bright areas. And also yung color, talaga nagpa-pop siya. Tapos pag madilim po, mga horror movies, kitang-kita po yung mga dark parts. Very detailed po and very atmospheric yung kanya mga scenes. Sa ordinary TV kasi guys, yung color ay parang medyo mm, flat. Medyo nakukulangan ako. Medyo hindi ganun ka-accurate. Kasi nga, 
ganun lang po yung available colors ng mga low dynamic range ng mga TVs. Actually, hindi lang sa Netflix, no? Nag-watch din kami ng YouTube 4K Costa Rica, our favorite, favorite clip on YouTube pang testing ng mga high-end display TVs. Bro, tinan mo to. So, ito si LJ and siya yung nga videographer namin and nakita niyo yung quality dun sa YouTube. So, ano masabi mo, bro? O oh, nga, sir. Eh. Uh, Na-blow na away po ako sa colors and brightness po ng display ng TV na to. Uwe, paano yung blown away? Tanga! Fake skill. <laughs> mabango, yung, mabango yung bibig mo, bro. Ah. Hindi, wow. Now, speaking of refreshing, yung kanyang refresh rate ay 60 hertz lang, guys. Wala po siyang 120, 90 hertz, mga ganun. It doesn't use a smoothening technology like other high-end TVs, but... Who cares about that? Kasi weird yung kanyang itsura. If you really want very cinematic videos, just get this one. For me, okay na to eh. Kasi 24 FPS na naman talaga kailangan ko sa mga cinematic videos or movies. Pero syempre, important yun sa gaming. Which is, malalaman nyo later kung okay ba siya. Pero to ah, napansin ko na for each scene, parang mas nagbabright siya, mas gumaganda yung color. Yun pala, meron siyang special feature called the Dynamic Color Enhancement, which enhances the display effect of the low color display to high color display, bringing them to life. And guys, meron siyang micro dimming, 1296 po yung kanyang micro dimming zones, which intelligently adjusts the brightness and darkness in each scene for a superior viewing experience. Kaya lang beans, wala akong pakailam sa video quality. Gusto ko lang yung sounds. Ano pa to speaker? TV to, di ba? Kaya lang beans, kailangan ko lang Dolby Atmos. Wala po siyang Dolby Atmos. Pero meron siyang Dolby Audio. This is it. I think this is the best part of this TV. Yung kanyang speakers. The audio on this thing is just totally different na. Marami ako na-review before na TV, no? Even my TV, which is a very, very known brand. Maganda din po yung sound nun, pero guys, tumatapat po to in terms of sound quality. Ang una namin napansin sa kanyang sound is sobrang crisp ng kanyang sound quality. Buong buo pa at very immersive. Yung parang meron siyang 180 degree na sound, stereo speakers, and it even has that bass, that punch. Boom! Also guys, you have to know na even though naka-max settings na siya, kahit 75 80, 90, 100 Hindi po sabog Pakinggan yung kanyang sound For the first time ever Guys, every TV I have ever reviewed Sabog ang sounds Hindi ko lang bakit Pero to guys It was able to control Alright Oh Oh, but guys, boom boom, parin siya. Wonderful. Na blown away ako. Di lang ka LJ. Pati pa rin sa TV. Saks kanya sound quality. Grabe guys. Thank you, thank you. Pero yun meron siyang Dolby Audio. Which delivers an immersive surround sound with Dolby Decoder, which optimizes the TV's sound quality. Okay, so ito yung aking video ng Aya Falcon a few months ago. And look at this. Press ko lang yung Chromecast and Smart TV. And boom. Ayan na. Anything na meron sa phone ko, ikakas na lang dun sa YouTube. And all you need to do is just press this icon right here. It has built-in Chromecast. Click mo lang yan, and it will cast sa TV. Boom. Oh, pala guys, meron pa siyang Google TV. Now, the IF Falcon 4K HDR Google TV is, you got it, a Google TV, guys. So, gumagamit po siya ng Google TV as its OS. And let me tell you, this Google TV OS is the best OS available for any kind of TV. Discover new movies and shows among your subscriptions and the content you can access. Receive recommendations based on your interests and what you've recently watched. Now, unlike other OS, no, ito po ay simple lang tingnan and for the first time din, Napansin namin, sobrang bilis po niya mag-navigate. Guys, ito yung pinaka-struggle ko sa mga TVs, even yung mga premium TVs na worth 200-300,000 pesos, which I have at my home. Ang bagal po ng interface ng mga TV. But this one, pero meron dito. Ang bilis naman masyado. Hindi ko sure kung ano yung kanyang processor, pero napaka-bilis. Every time we switch apps, parang almost instant yung nating sa amin. Very smooth. Pero ito guys, ganito, ganito ako gumamit ng TV sa bahay. Ito nito. So, all you need to do is press this Google button right here on the controller and Mr. Suave, karaoke. Got it. Here are some videos. Ay, ang bilis naman. Let's do this. Nasa ula ba? Ang yung mga mata. Oh. Monetization. Okay. Pero yan, pwede ka mag-search ng kahit ano. Gamit lang to. Unbox Diaries. Sure, here are some videos. 
Wow, ang bilis. Basketball. Here's what I found on YouTube. Boom. Football. Here's what I found on YouTube. K-drama. Alright, showing K-drama TV shows. <laughs> Meron sa ano? Netflix. Opening, Netflix. Wow. Hi, Tetch. Play Squid Game on Netflix. Alright, here's Squid Game on Netflix. Volume, 25%. Got it. Volume, 75%. Got it. Turn off the TV. Sorry, it looks like the TV isn't available right now. Go back to YouTube. Opening, YouTube. Guys, magical! So baka din nyo pa alam, ganun pa ako gumamit ng TV and it's so convenient, hindi na pa magta-type dito kasi nga wala pong keypad na madali pong mag-type which is, alam nyo naman, kapag ka sa YouTube ang hirap di ba pa isa-isa This one makes your life much, much easier By the way guys, mayroon pa siyang Google Watch List and it's one list for all your discoveries When you see an interesting show or movie, pwede mo siyang i-add sa watch list mo to keep track of new discoveries. Now overall, this TV really blew us away. Milawin natin mo. Pero in compared to other TVs that I reviewed, this one is actually the best. The best in video quality, the best in audio quality, the best in pretty much everything, and even the features. Pati yung kanyang bilis, pati yung kanyang implementation ng kanyang voice control is actually the best. It's even better than my TV sa bahay, which is a very expensive one. And it's... It doesn't even compare. Siguro ang bagay na aking processor. Ang daya naman. Dapat nilalagay yung mga processor or may update lang naman sa mga lubang TV. But yes, the... The functionality on this thing is just incredible. Wala pong bugs ako nakita. Ang smooth niya pang gamitin. Pero guys, if you buy sa 9.9 sale, ito po yung kasama niya. Everything is up to 60% off. Meron pa siyang free shipping, may cashback, and meron ka pang Lazada voucher. And guys, meron pa siyang freebies. Meron siyang free wall bracket para sa 32-inch IF Falcon TV. And if you get the 65 inches na IF Falcon TV, meron kang free S332W soundbar for the first 5 buyers. Kung gusto mo na aircon nila, no, meron siya lang aircon. May freebie din. Free Briva A2 for the first 5 buyers of 1.5 HP inverter split type AC. And guys, meron pa siyang voucher giveaways. Kung isa ka sa first nang bibili ng 50-inch and 55-inch IF Falcon TV, meron kang extra 990 pesos off na voucher. And kapag bumili ka naman ng 1 horsepower window type AC for the first 3 buyers, Meron kang extra 990 pesos off. Wow. 9.9. Kamusta naman? Hey, what are you waiting for? Go get this TV right now. Because I would. Masampo. At ibibit ako sa inyo. Para may commission ako. Kapal na mukha mo! Okay. <laughs> Actually, sa sobrang ganda po niya, gagamitin ko po siya sa aking uh, office. This one deserves a place in my office. This one is really good. Thank you so much, Aya Falcon, for letting me review this wonderful product of yours. And guys, if you want to see more TV, Reviews just like this one, and subscribe below. Hit the bell icon so you don't miss any of my great content. Let's be insane. You're watching Unbox Series. Woohoo!